This podcast is brought to you by the Northern Lights Council of the Boy Scouts of America. Cub Scouts is the nation's foremost youth program for character development and values-based leadership training. In the future, scouting will continue to offer young people responsible fun and adventure, instill in young people lifetime values, and develop in them ethical character, train young people in citizenship, service, and leadership, and serve America's communities and families with its quality, values-based program. Learn more at nlcbsa.org. I'm Storm Tracker Meteorologist Charles Picard with your Northland Outdoors forecast for what looks to be a beautiful Labor Day weekend. Friday going on into the weekend, no clouds really throughout much of the region. We are going to see a few clouds off and on, and we do have a couple of warmer days. However, by Saturday morning, we are tracking that chance for a brief shower along the Canadian border. However, that is basically going to be the extent of what we expect for rain this weekend. By Saturday afternoon, we are seeing plenty of sun throughout much of the region, and we are going to keep that in for Saturday evening. Now, going on into Saturday night, again, you could still see a couple of sprinkles across the North Shore. However, that, again, not too many chances of rain, few and far between. And then as we head on into Sunday, once again, Plenty of sun, that rain moves on out, and while we are going to see a few clouds across the Dakotas in the afternoon, overall still a rather mild weekend, and that is continuing on into Monday, where we do get a bit more of a south breeze, but once again, another sunny day, and only a few clouds passing through. Now for the wind, we are going to see that pick up a little for this weekend. Friday and Saturday looking to be the gustiest days. And Saturday afternoon, that's when the winds really pick up across the northern parts of the region, mainly getting to around 10 to 20 miles an hour. However, Saturday is probably going to be the best day to have that breeze because we are going to be a little warmer with temperatures in the 80s for most. Then heading on into Sunday, we still see a light wind at times. However, that mainly calms on down. And then by Monday afternoon, we do start to see that breeze pick up across the central parts of South Dakota and North Dakota. However, again, mainly around 10 to 20 miles an hour. And with that breeze, it will keep that air moving about for an otherwise sunny and beautiful day throughout the region. Now for Saturday, temperature-wise, again, as mentioned, that breeze is going to help out for some because otherwise we have temperatures getting a little warm and hot at points in the 90s across much of South Dakota, 80s for much of Minnesota, and 70s with a few more clouds across North Dakota. Then as we head on into Saturday, temperatures are going to get a little more mild. We see 60s across much of the Northland, and we see that get into the 70s for central Minnesota and much of the Dakotas, with the only 80s out towards Rapid City. Then for Labor Day, again, plenty of sun, mild weather for most 70s across much of the region, although we are going to start to warm up again throughout the week with temperatures returning to the 80s by midweek.